Okay, hello YouTube, this is Ahoy. So this is a bonus video for me getting 100 subscribers, so thank you everybody. And um, this bonus video is an extension to the MIDI Learn tutorial that I have. Because uh, when I was checking through the Cubase manual and uh, browsing the internet, I noticed that uh, in the Cube quick controls you can only assign 8 controls, but you know, at least my keyboard has like... Uh, eight uh, rotator parts and then it has nine faders and then it also has these uh, playhead like play pause rewind fast forward uh, cycle and record buttons so i was wondering like how i can like uh, assign those so i went uh, through the manual and uh, you do it like this you go the devices device setup and then on the remote devices you quick you click on the remote devices and then you press plus and then you select a uh, generic remote and i have the axiom here and i made this uh, i made this template before so here is the loop i um, press learn and then i press that button and then it's there actually looks like it saved all the things that i uh, set there and what you can do is uh, this i usually name something other i think it sa starts with fader one and uh, so you can just name this say this is the cycle and then it also names it here so what you do is th and then you select what kind of assignment it's doing so you select a transport device and uh, cycle but for example i rarely use the rewind and fast forward but uh, i do use markers so if i use the markers here uh, i have the marker track here uh, let's put the snap on so now i have four markers there okay so let's go to the device setup and this is the rewind and uh, let's see go to previous marker and go to next marker and when i press them on my keyboard they are there so that's basically if i would be recording so i have this empty track here i'd say ah fuck that undo and then rewind and break again and basically that is how you set up the uh, quick controls uh, sorry, you actually can set up everything here. I have the faders here, I have the fan pots here, and then I noticed that uh, these program change buttons don't work, so I'll just remove them. And then I ha also have the faders if I want to assign them to something. Uh, they are currently assigned to something like. But um, let's say it, I want to put these pads to uh bst mixer selected and uh, let's put it to mute okay and uh let's put it to the empty track now as you can see it's uh in some funny mode so that when i let loose uh the mute goes off so let's uh, change the how it works so this is the pad one so this is the toggle and now it works just fine and um, for the cycle you have also have to do the toggle because oh, and you also need to put the push button so let's uh, do the cycle without the toggle uh, as you can see it turns on but it doesn't turn off so we have to use the toggle and i heard that if you use the not automated it doesn't have any latency when you press the button so now it's working just the way it's supposed to be so uh so for the record just select the push button and not automated and uh, for the stop actually i could try to do like delete instead because uh, i can just press play 
and it becomes a toggle, you know. So let's see if, if this actually has like a delete command. So edit, delete, here it is. So basically, if I now have the, I'll unmute it, record, press play. Oh, I need to, uh, I think I need to like, actually I'll try it again. Okay, I need to have the stop there also. Or I can just do that and then just press the stop. Yes, it works. So basically you can put like these pads here and use them for the delete and whatever you want to use. Boom. And uh, I think I have actually the faders assigned to the EQ. At least I did. So if I have the fader selected EQ gain and let's put the pan to selected and EQ frequency and let's put the pan number to the type it's the Q okay so now it's Okay, and uh, this is this is Q, and maybe if we change, and if we put the type there also, it might be very versatile. But anyway, um, I hope you found this uh, tutorial interesting, and uh, thank you for watching and make it music. <laughs>